in the fly lab, dissecting fruit fly brains. Oh, hello, I'm Dipanshu, a PhD student, and I'm studying how pathogens interact with our brains. You may have heard of the zombie fungus, which controls the behavior of their host as a mean to protect their own survival. In fact, both host and pathogens compete with each other for survival. Pathogens have evolved different strategies to infect and manipulate their host. And I want to understand how the fungi affect the brain. Do they affect the brain structure or not? Or do they affect how the fly behave? To understand how fungi affect the brain, we need to have a clear view of the fly brain. But how do we do that? Because they are so tiny. The average size of the fly is 3 millimeters. So to dissect the fly brain, I use a stereo microscope and a razor sharp forcer. This is a time dependent experiment in which I aim to dissect at least 10 brains in 20 minutes. As soon as I dissect the brain, I have to transfer the brain into the fixative to stop all the reactions in the brain and to make the brain ready for the next step that is the immunostaining. 